first tutorial video, you learned a little bit about how to actually create your website and the home page uh, was created by default. In this second tutorial, we're going to take a brief look at how I want you to actually name your site and design the header so that uh, it, it does what we want it to do from the standpoint of me being able to access your work. One of the things I want you to notice is that you're going to have a chance to actually name your website on this line. And I really don't have a lot of uh, uh, preference for what you name your website. Uh, my suggestion is your last name and the title of the course, which is Advanced Technology Integration. If that's what you decide to use, simply type it on this line and then move on. The key here is that on the header, you want to put your first name and last name, and that way I'll be able to clearly identify your work and uh, the, the, the various things that you post to the website as being uh, given to your credit. The section immediately below it, call it a little about me and just simply provide a little bit of biographical information about yourself. Uh, nothing too personal that you wouldn't want uh, the World Wide Web to have access to, but just some basic information, in, information, just a little bit of an introduction about your work that appears on this website. In subsequent tutorial videos, you'll take a look at adding pages and uh, finally completing the process of publishing your website to the World Wide Web.